Hello, my pioneers, my forward thinking game changers. My name is Ruben Christian, and welcome to the Network Hour, a show where you guys can learn how to start relationships out of thin air. Professional relationships? The elevator pitch is your first step towards becoming a networking god. Hey, Mr. CEO. Good to see you, buddy. Good to see you. Uh, Ruben, right? Yes. Oh, yeah, I've yeah. heard a lot of good things about you. Nice. So, um, nice. what is it that you do then, exactly? Well, you know, I like, I like merge all my talents together and just give it uh, out to the world, like all my stuff inside me. Uh, it's like a mixture of stuff, like I'm a creative guy, people's person obviously. I write a bit of comedy, I present, I get up stage, talk to people, and I just know together all my creative ideas and my whole team. That's not an elevator pitch. That's the ramblings of an unprepared b An elevator pitch is a sentence that sums up what you do so concisely that you can tell it in a space of your average elevator ride. If you were to write it down, it'd be about 140 characters, which is about a tweet. So, let's try that again, shall we? Hey, Mr. CEO, good to see you, sir. Good to see you. Hi, Ruben, right? Yes, yeah. Oh, I've heard a lot of good things about you. Okay, nice. So, what is it you do then, actually? I'm a presenter and a comic. I host live events and I make online comedy videos. And I'm also co-founder of individualism.co.uk, which is the UK's leading men's star blog. Oh, excellent. Um, I've got a few events coming up and we could okay. uh, do with your services. Um, have you got wow. a card, haven't you? I do. Yes, I do. There you go. I'll, I'll be in touch. Thank you. Thank you. Have a nice day, mate. See? Preparation, it got me some potential work with the CEO of this whole company. Yeah. Did you see a men's styling blog? I did, yeah. Man, I've been looking for a stylist. Ah, and possibly another client. Although that's too much work, man. Remember guys, your elevator pitch should be short and to the point, even if you do live on the 100th floor. You need to know exactly what you do, as you do not want to give people the wrong idea. I've been Ruben Christian, 